proper fraction. One of the examples is one fourth. In proper fraction, five fourths. How to add similar fraction without regrouping? Just add the numerator, then copy the denominator. 3 eighths plus 3 eighths is equal to 6 eighths. Or, reduce to the lowest term, 3 fourths. How to add the similar fraction? 2 divided by 15 plus 3 divided by 5. All you have to do to get the LCD. So 15 divided by 15 is 1. 1 times 2 is 2. 15 divided by is 3 times 3 is equals to 9. So 2 plus 9 is equals to 11. So copy the 15 and the answer is 11 15. How to subtract same denominator? Number 1. Subtract the numerators. Keep the same the denominator. 5 8 minus 2 8 is equal to 3 8. So subtracting a fraction. How to subtract the similar terms? 3 fourths minus 1 third. All you have to do is to get the LCD. 12 divided by 4 is 3. So 3 times 3 is 9. 12 divided by 3 is 4. 4 times 1 is 4. So 9 minus 4 is 5. And copy the denominator of 12. So the answer is 5 12. Hey guys, welcome sa YouTube channel ko. Today's video, pag-aaralan natin ang addition of fraction. Mar dalawang klase yan. Similar fraction and dissimilar fraction. Pag sinabi mong similar, pareho ang denominator. Take note, ang one half ay kinatawag na uh, proper fraction. Pag in proper fraction, mas mataas ang numerator kaysa denominator. So, ang ano lang bang gagawin natin? Kung ito ay similar. So, ito ay, add mo lang, 1 plus 3 divided by 2. So, 4 divided by 2 is equal to 2. Okay, ganyan na. Ito naman, 2 third plus 6 divided by 3. So, add mo siya. This will become 8 divided by 3. Ito ba ay tamang sagot? Hindi pa yan. Kasi yun Proper fraction. So, paano mo makukuha yung pinakatamang sagot? Siyempre, divide to 8, divide to 3, so 2, 3, so 2. So, the answer is 3, 2, 3. So, this will be the final answer. Yes. So, 5 naman. 1 divided by 5 plus 2 divided by 5. Same pa rin. So, Okay, what if ang given natin 3, 1 half, plus 2, okay. Then, uh, 3 over 2. Okay, halimbawa, meron tayong example na ganito. So, ang gagawin mo naman, ito ita times mo. So, 3 times 2, 6 plus 1, maging 7 over 2, plus 3 over 2. Bawa naman ko 3, 1 third, plus 4, 2 third. Okay. Anong gagawin natin? Ang gagawin natin. So, 3 times 3 is 9. 9 plus 1, so 10, divided by 3, 
4 times 3 is 12 plus 2 will become 14 divided by 3. So the answer is uh, 10 plus 14 will become 24. 24 divided by 3. 24 divided by 3 will become 3. Okay, may technique pa ako dyan, ha? Actually, 3 plus 4, 7. 1 third plus 2 third will become 1. So, 7 plus 1 will become 2, ha? 3 plus 4, 7. 1 third plus 2 third will become 3 divided by 3 is equal to 1. So, 1 plus 7 will be equal to get you ba ako? So, I hope nagigit niya na. May mga iba kasing technique. Eh. Marukad tumingin. Madali lang siya. 3 plus 4, 7. So, itong 1 third. Add mo sa 2 third. So, 2 plus 3. So, it becomes uh, 3 over 3 plus 7. So, 7, 7 plus 3 is equal to ito ha. Papalitan mo siya ng 1. So, the answer is 3 divided by 3 is 1. 1 plus 7 is equal to So, yan. May mga technique and method din ako ibibigay sa inyo para masolve na yung addition of action. Similar ha. Parehong denominator. So, next natin will be dissimilar. Hi guys! Welcome again sa YouTube channel ko. Ang susunod kong uh, itatapi is all about dissimilar fraction. Pag sinabi mong dissimilar fraction, iba yung denominator. This form of denominator. Matulad to, 1 half plus 3 over 4. So, alam natin dapat meron tayong tinatawag sa LCD. So, ang LCD 2 and 4 is uh, 4. 4 divided by 3 is 2. Multiply mo sa 1. 4 divided by 4 is 1 multiplied with 3. So, the answer is 3 plus 3 over 4 is 6 over 4. Or the answer is, so, binibide mo yung 6. So, 6 divided by 4, we have 2. So, I sorry. 1 and then 4 over 2. So, the answer is, 1, 2 over 4, 4, 1, and 1 half. So, this will be our final answer. Pag hindi nakaganyan yung answer mo, mali pa rin kasi hindi siya nakareduce to the lowest term. Again, so, erase natin ito. So, ito naman, anong ALC dito, 5 and 6, 30. 30 divided by 5, a6, multiply mo by 2. 30 divided by 6 is 5. Multiply mo by 3. 6 times 2 is 12. Plus 15 divided by 30. Ito ay 17 over 30. So, ito na yung pinaka-final answer. Wala nang iba kasi hindi naman siya ma-reduce sa lowest term dahil hindi sila pareho Okay, so ganito naman, 2 and 1 half plus 3 and 1 fourth. Equal natin, 2 times 2, 4 plus 1 will become 5 over 2. 3 times 4 is 12 plus 1, 13 over 4. Tama? Bitin ko ha, 2 times 2 is 1 plus 2 times 2 is 4 plus 1, 5 over 2. 3 times 4 is 12 plus 1, 13 over 2. And at the same time, the LCD will become 4, 4 divided by 2 is 2 times 5, 4 divided by 4 is 1 times mo sa 13, so 2 times 5 is 10 plus 13 divided by 4, so the answer is 23 divided by 4, the answer is 10. Yan ang final answer. So, ito ah, dissimilar fraction siya. So, pag sinabi mong dissimilar, they have different denominator. And what will you do is to find first the LCD. Okay? So, 
yan ang uh, topic na So, susunod natin ay subtraction. Ang subtraction, parang ganun din. Same as, uh, uh, ano, sinubtract mo lang yung uh, pareho lang siya sa addition of fraction. So, yung susunod natin. Okay. So, let, guys, welcome to my YouTube channel again. Let's discuss about subtraction of fraction using the similar. Okay. So, same din. Kunin mo yung LCD. Ito, wala ng LCD to eh. Kumbaga, pareho na silang uh, denominator. So, 3 minus 2 6. So, the answer is 1 over 6. Yun lang. 3 times 4 is 12 plus 1. We have 13 over 4 minus we have 2 times 9 over 4. Tama. And then, Subtract mo, 13 minus 9, ilan? Is uh, 4 over 4 is equal to 1. Okay. And then, ito, 3 minus 2, 1 lang. Oh. 1. Tapos, 1 half minus 1 half is 0. So, 1 plus 0 is equal pareho siya sa final answer na yan. And then, 5 minus 2 is 3 over 9. So, 3 divided by 3 is 1 third. Kasi pag ang answer mo ay hindi naka lowest term, mamamali ka pa rin. Dapat laging naka-reduce to the lowest term. Okay, ay. Technique, technique lang yan. Okay, susunod natin ay, susunod natin example. So, pag sinabi mong subtract of fraction dissimilar uh, this say uh, similar or dissimilar they have different denominators so automatic pag ganito 3 times 4 is 3 times 8 is 24 plus 1 will become 25 by 8 2 times 2 is 4 plus 1 will become 5 so 2 and the LCD is 8 8 divided by 8 is 1. Multiply 25. 8 divided by 2 is 4. Multiply mo sa 5. And then 25 minus 20 over 8. The answer is 5 over 8. So this will be our final answer. Next. LCD pa rin. This common denominator is 9. 9 divided by 9 is 1. Multiply mo sa 3. 9 divided by 3 is 3 times 1. So, ito ay 3 minus 3. And the answer is 0 divided by 9 is 0. Correct? And then, if we have this one, 6 Ano ba LCD? 6 divided by 6 is 1 multiply mo sa 5 and then 6 divided by 6 6 divided by 3 is 2 multiply mo sa 2 and then 5 minus 2 over 6 is 1 over 6 So this will be our final answer for this uh, topic, subtraction, subtraction. So, I hope you guys can be on your lesson natin kung kayo ay grade 11 na or grade 12 meron kayong karapatan mag gumamit ng calculator. Sa calculator meron na yan. Okay. So, thank you very much guys. I hope you will understand to this lesson.